What is up you guys, Michael from CultureShockCollectibles.com and today we are checking out the Batman Forever wave of DC Multiverse figures. These have just landed at CultureShockCollectibles.com and damn, are they impressive. Really, really hit it out of the ballpark here, Uncle Todd, with some absolutely stunning figures. Let's start from the top with the man himself. It is, of course, Val Kilmer's Batman in that sort of sonar looking suit from the movie a little bit different to what we first start the movie in but equally as great suit and you can see the head sculpt is pretty cool love that they've got that sort of val kilmer chin and lip down pat right there the suit detail is really nice on this as well down to the boots and the cloth cape which is going to be awesome for the batmobile when that comes out because I know in some of the past iterations of the uh, Batman movie figures they have been the stiff sort of plastic capes but this is going to be great for popping him in the Batmobile so good work there from McFarlane in the box of course it comes with a couple of batarangs and a grapnel gun a couple of other hand sculpts and of course the man bat head and the collector card with some great artwork there in the back. I'm not going to take the man bat out right now. I just want to go through the figures currently. Next up, of course, Tommy Lee Jones uh, as Harvey Dent, Two Face. And this is another phenomenal figure. Have a look at that. Just the colors and the deco hits through this figure absolutely pop. And just really make it. You can see the uh, civilian head i'll call it or tommy lee head and of course he does come as well with the coin flick hand sculpts you can see he's flicking that coin into the air so that's pretty cool comes with the c grip gun hand sculpt as well unfortunately no gun on this one comes with the collector card another c grip gun hand sculpt but without the glove and another gloved hand sculpt and the giant wing very gargoyles-esque when it comes to the wing i found like just the way it's been built similar to what necker did with the gargoyles pretty cool next up jim carrey as the riddler this is definitely up there probably you know it's a tough one for me because it's either robin or, or riddler for this wave as the mvp um uma thurman's poison ivy last sort of release in the movie figures absolutely blew me away and this is not too far off it i've got to admit like that head sculpt is pretty damn wicked you've got the cane as well the riddler cane full riddler outfit in vibrant vibrant green very cool figure that is for sure comes with the uh man bat body the collector card a little riddler bomb and two other hand sculpts as well as the stands and all that stuff. So definitely up there in this wave for me as my MVP. But this here is 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 pretty awesome as well. I, I've got to admit, I'm finding it very hard to, to work out a favourite between these two. It is, of course, the Chris O'Donnell Batman psychic Robin figure. Love that it's got the uh, the Robin symbol there on it as well. Really cool sort of... Um, outfit as well from the movie i've always liked this style of outfit for robin similar to you know the batman animated series and all that sort of stuff with the green and the and the red head sculpts not too too bad as well for chris o'donnell but the thing that makes this figure absolutely wild is the wired cape we didn't get that on the last chris o'donnell robin figure so it is so good to have that wired cape be included in this one thought it could be cool that if they did the batman figure as well but then i'm thinking okay yeah maybe not because of the batmobile but just the the quality of this cape like it is it is so thick uh, you can just sort of see the absolute quality of it and and the fact that it's got the two tone through it the wires are through the sides there so you will be able to bend that into into all different shapes and do some pretty cool posing with it i'm sure but just for display purposes, it's it's absolutely stunning out of the box. Comes, of course, with the collector card. Loving the collector cards in the McFarlane figures. A few more hand sculpts. Another wing piece for the Man Bat figure. Man Bat figure is definitely going to be impressive. So we might do another video on that. But this is just another awesome addition to the DC multiverse. And Batman movie 
sort of assortments that have been released so far. So looking forward to some more of these and looking forward to the Batmobile and getting this bad boy in the Batmobile.